And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda A Link to the Past. Last time I displayed my exquisite video gaming ignorance by not knowing that the princess is called Princess Zelda. So she is a girl. Or Zelda is a girl. I can't hit for crud. Yeah, and I didn't know about um, the save game mechanics in this game. Looked up in the manual. That is, I looked up the manual on the internet uh, and the enemies respawn, of course. Then giving you also opportunity to replenish your health. On the other hand, so I looked up this issue on the manual and it appears that there is no such thing as a final game over in this game. At least I think that's the case. At least I thought that was the case. Um, and continue without no continue without saving means um, that you get to retry, but nothing is changed. So that essentially you can retry. Um, we're given a retry. Okay, we have the map. Yeah, we do have the map. Fantastic. Okay, let's do redo this part which we did last time, but then I died out of stupidity. So kill this man. Also something which um, didn't show you yet is the second attack. Okay, we still... Oh, we already read that. Yes, I have the map. And I can use it to see my current location. Wait, didn't I already have the map? Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, I did fall down there last time and I... I wrongly suspected that the game pushed me down, but it was just my inability to control. Okay, let's do this. You can charge. You can charge your sword uh, by pressing down and holding down the B button. Do, do, do. Chances are that you already know that. Because chances are, if you watch this Let's Play, you know this game, and you know this Zelda franchise, probably infinitely better than me. Just, just I just showed you back then that I didn't even know that it was that the princess called Zelda, even though it um, is one of the main facts that you should know. Probably, I always confuse Zelda and Link. It's probably because I never played a Zelda game before. Okay, it is a dungeon crawler. In case you haven't noticed. And the Zelda games have basically defined this genre. At least according to some source, namely Wikipedia. That could very well be. I'm not quite sure when Ultima 1 came out, or Ultima 4, really the start of the Ultima series. I actually intended, or I played with the idea of starting a let's play of uh, Ultima 1, no, not, not Ultima 1, Ultima 4, I mean. Yeah, I've got the boomerang again. Let's select it, actually. But I think it was a wise, wise decision not to do that at this point because my experience with RPG games in general. Okay, I just said some complete nonsense there. RPG is an abbreviation for role playing game, so RPG game would be role playing game game. Anyway, 
So my exposures to role-playing games games basically consists of Deus Ex. Some of you might even challenge the fact that Deus Ex is in fact a, a role-playing game, not just any role-playing game, but a superb and fantastic and great and super duper role-playing game. And there's, there she is, and there's the first boss. And I can stun him. Yeah, I think this um, boomerang will pose to be useful. Um, okay, if it does any damage at all, maybe it just stuns him. Oh, yeah, I should. Yeah, I think it only stuns him. It doesn't really do any damage. But he does damage to me. And I'm almost dead again. Okay. I haven't yet figured out this. Um, shit. Ugh. Okay, let's do do not save and continue and see what happens. Okay, this happens. Hmm. Maybe I should have chosen save and continue. Okay, let's do this quickly. Just ignore those guys. Because I know where we have to go. We have to go down there. See? Learning from experience. Guess you didn't think you would see that in my last place. And we already opened that chest. So we just remember something about the game state. I will push him over. And then I will push him over too. No, I fail. Because I am unable to play this game. Okay, I will just wait for them, for them to show up. Here they are. Those cowards. I haven't, I'm having a, uh, a few troubles with the out audio. Not sure if it's the game or if it's the emulator, which would be Hegan. Name of the emulator that is. I'm playing the performance version. Um, because I experienced some performance issues with a different Super Nintendo game with Clock Tower. Oh, I don't have to. Okay. Didn't have to go in there again, actually. Because that the game remembers my process. Not my process, my progress. I still haven't figured out how to. Ah, I still I got my uh, boomerang. Okay, they appear to be stunned for much longer than the boss. Which makes sense. Let's try to do this boss fight again. And yet rescue our princess. I wonder why now feminist complains about those Zelda games. Maybe they do. Probably they do. Look! Stereotypical a stereotypical global. Damsel in distress. This is sexist. Shit. 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 And I died. Oops. Um, let's see what happens when I press save and continue. Okay, I end up at the same place. 
So not quite sure what's the different the difference between save and continue and just continue. I will ignore you. No, I kill you. Of course, I want that heart. Okay, didn't drop a heart. Don't be so hard on me. Ugh. That, ladies and gentlemen, was a joke. Okay, I will try to trick them. Aha! I will just... Okay, I can't jump down there. Never mind. Yeah, and there's still some minor audio glitches whenever I enter or leave a level. Do, 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 do. Goodbye to you. Do, 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 do. Let's get my sword out. Do, do. And I will kill you with impunity. No, I will fail. Simple as that. Let's see if I can kill the boss this time. Okay, I can assure you that I never got this far into this game when I first played it. Which does not sound very impressive. It sounds very unimpressive. Maybe even awkward. By the way, I got a new subscriber, someone from Poland, who has voiced his opinion that my or that I am awkward. I would like to resent that, but I think that my let's plays and my channel they are indeed a bit awkward. So your observation did in fact contain a grain of, grain of truth. I guess everyone has his own style at playing video games. Some people like to be very excellent and show off their skills. I like to be very, very bad and show off my inability. As I just, as I did just then, as I did again, and even more inability. Shit. Okay, I think this man is screwing with my controls. It must be some voodoo magic, I would suppose. I think I called him Bowser at one point, didn't I? Did I call him Bowser? People who watch this let's play, chances are that this statement refers to an empty set. Please tell me if I said Bowser. Okay, you got the big key. This is the master key of the dungeon. It can open many locks that small keys cannot. Oh, how sad. Those poor small keys. They can't open all the locks. How sad. And why did no one tell me that my timer is about to run up in two seconds? That means that we will see ourselves in the next episode. So until next time folks, until then.